Hey, what's going on guys, Blues here. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to get Observation Hike V2. This is the last thing you should probably try. If you haven't tried anything else, this will 100% complete it every time. It will take a lot longer to be able to complete it just because of how much it's slowed down, but this is 100% completion rate. So again, this is the app you're going to need. I'm sure many of you have heard about this. If you haven't, what you need to do is download this app. Some of you might get it registered as a virus, but in my eyes, it's completely safe. I've been using it for around a year and a half and I don't need to worry about anything had absolutely zero problems anyway i'm going to show you here now so what you need to do is head to the description of this video and click on the link it's going to be a link to this website and down here you will see three things you want to click the top one which is this one and it will download so i have it already downloaded so i'm just going to exit out right here you need to right click on this and extract here if not you go down to properties click on change switch to file explorer and then apply and extract it that way. This will get this folder right here. So once you've gotten this folder, you need to click in. As you can see, it's right here. What you're gonna need is a settings file. So to be able to get the settings file, you need to click on it, just double click. It should open a thing and click settings. So now that you have this file, what you need to do is right click it, go open with, you need to click on notepad, open. As you see here, this might be a bit confusing, but you'll see FPS cap values right here goes from 30 all the way to 360. So what we need to do is create our own one. So you'll want to just copy it from here. So you want to copy this part. You'll want to paste it right there. Make sure you put a space right at the end and change this value to two. Once you've changed this value to two, you just click save as. Switch this to all files. Once you've clicked all files, you click here, save and done. So once you've done that, you just quickly relaunch the program. So as you see here, double click, relaunched it, and I'll see you in game. All right, so now that we're over in game and you have everything ready, what you need to do is go up to the NPC, talk to him and stop just before you get to the okay button. So as you can see, what we need to do now is go in and make sure you open this, make sure it's the right one. Open that, if this pops up, it is working. Go down the bottom right, right click your FPS unlocker, and as you'll see, there's a value of two. If you don't have a value of two, you've done something wrong, but you should have a value of two. So don't start it yet. What we're gonna need to do is after we click okay, is we're gonna go back in here and quickly set it to two, because sometimes there's a glitch which will overlap it and sometimes not work. So I recommend doing this in a private server. You can do this in a public, but if it glitches, it's not your fault. Anyway, let's click okay. So what you want to do now is once the countdown starts, head over and set this value to two, just before it reaches zero. So it's now hit one, we've turned it on. As you can see, it's slowed down quite a bit and you will see like one or two frames each time you see a circle. So just take your time and just click on them when you think you can. So hopefully I do this without missing once. If I do, I'm gonna show you the score that I get. And it's actually not gonna be very high because you can see how slow the circles are. So as you can see there, we've passed it. So just gonna quickly go back and everything is finished. That's gonna be it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you found this helpful, make sure to drop a like and a sub and go join my Discord. Anyway, see you in the next one. Peace, peace.